As you're shopping for a saber bat, just like every other training tool that you are researching and looking at, you want to know exactly why do I need a training bat like the saber? Why is the saber the one that I need to buy? Okay, and what does it actually do? So as you look at the saber, yes, it has a rounded side and a flat side. The purpose of that is to make sure that you get behind the ball and drive the ball. This is gonna give you instant feedback, okay? If the hitter is just barely missing, they're gonna feel it, all right? The other biggest thing about this is it's a real bat. We make it out of rock hard maple, the same as we do our game bats and every other major league um, large company makes their most, 85% of their bats out of rock hard maple. It's gonna be durable, but the biggest thing is it's going to mimic the real swing and the real game feel. So the body needs to train like it's gonna play. But the problem with other training tools is they do not have the exact same feel as what your game bat is. So when we get back into max efforts and we're facing velocity, we're trying to take our best, most powerful cut, our body is gonna revert back to what it knows before. But with the Sabre bat, because it's the same handle, it's the same weight, it's the same length, it's the same feel, it's the same barrel size this way, okay? We modify the flat side so that you have to get directly behind it. Don't worry about hearing words like launch angle and am I on plane? If you can take this ball and hit with about a 1.8 inch barrel at speeds with real balls at real game velocity swings, when you go back to your swing, it's gonna play. You're gonna have higher batting average because you're gonna square more balls up. The balls that you've been practicing and you've been barely nipping, you now are gonna be directly behind. Your batting average is going to go up. If you'll do the work, it is a guarantee that your batting average is going up. Why does the power go up? Well, because we're making better contact solid. We're not worried about necessarily driving every ball out of the park. But if we've got a guy that's six foot five and the ball's coming at this angle, and then we have a guy that's five foot four and the ball's coming at this angle, we don't have to worry about whether we are on plane or we have the right launch angle, all those analytical numbers, because this Sabre bat is going to train you to get behind every pitch, whether it's over the top, down on the side, a short guy, ball with cut, you're going to have to get behind the ball. Okay. So again, it mimics the real swing. It mimics the real game feel of your bat. You're gonna have a higher average. You're gonna have more power. You're gonna have less miss hits, so less strikeouts. All around, if you look at what is out there for the training world, the Sabre bat is untouchable. Everything else has their hands in a different position, or it's a thicker handle, or it has a audible noise. Yet none of those are what you're gonna play with. If you were going to train, you have to train like you play. If you expect that swing that you're working so hard on to take over. And that's exactly why you need a Sabre bat versus any other training tool that's on the market.